Tomorrow night, you'll be taking the kiddos out to go trick-or-treating. And in this week's Positive Parenting segment, we're offering up some frighteningly easy tips to help make sure your child has a safe, fun Halloween. 33 News reporter Samantha Bender explains. Halloween. It's a highly anticipated holiday. Children are ramped up. They're so excited. They've been waiting for this for months. Um, they're so excited to show off their costumes. So they're in trick-or-treat, Halloween, have fun mode. So as a parent, you need to be in safety mode. Bill McMahon, Akron Children's Injury Prevention Coordinator, says candy safety is always a big concern, especially when kids have all kinds of different diabetic and nutritional deficiencies. I always recommend give them a good meal before they head out trick-or-treating so they're not tempted to reach into that bag and just start you know, going at the candy and pounding it. And whether you're in a neighborhood you're familiar with or not, make sure you inspect each piece of candy. Throw caution uh, to anything that may look homemade or is, is unwrapped, is not properly sealed, uh, unless, of course, you know um, those people really well. And it's getting darker earlier here in the Valley, especially as we approach daylight saving time. McMahon says we see the highest percentage of children hit by cars on Halloween overemphasize with them that we don't run out between parked cars uh, because oncoming traffic may not be able to see them. We stay on sidewalks where it's available. Um, if not, we're going against the direction of the traffic. He recommends wearing reflective clothing and using crosswalks when available. And always be aware of who's in your group and stick together. With this week's Positive Parenting segment, I'm Samantha Bender.